Five years ago, if someone had told me that I was doing what I'm doing now, I would have laughed and said, no way. What are you talking about? Five years ago, there were people doing surgery to look like the next doll collection. I don't understand personally. I don't understand photographers. I mean, if if you compare it with YouTube, the worst thing, you know, to to YouTube that you could be doing is being a photographer. I mean, that's just a perv move doing things like, yeah, turn around. Oh, beautiful. I lay on the ground. Don't say a word. Growl at me. Growl at me. What kind of bullshit is that, man? I mean, goddamn it, a fucking monkey can hold a camera and take photos. But, you know, the professionals, they take pride in that shit. It's too weird, too creepy, really. But now I can't imagine not doing it. No, it's not too weird, is it? What are you talking about, weird? You Hefner made a living from taking photos of prunes, you know? And you're just cool about it. You know, you're, you're cool, man. I gotta give it to you, man. <laughs> I'm a big fan. Shit, if you take those photos, sell it as a as a play toy or whatever, you know, I'll buy it. Shit, I'll buy it. You're cool about it and everything. You're like, yeah, it's not weird. No, I mean, uh, just five years ago when I had a real job, uh, you know, ever since then, I just hit puberty. I just hit it. You know, I've just been aroused ever since. You know, you're just so cool, man. I love you, man. I love you, man. Can I get your autograph? My name is Dean Bevan. I'm a retired psychiatric nurse, and I am a doll photographer. All right, Pete, to the legend, you Hefner. Um, but you know, his time has passed, and now it's time for for Mr. Dean Dean Hefner to pick up the crumbs. And psychiatric nurse, I'm sorry, you Hefner. I mean, he saw more prunes than the grade himself. I'm sorry, there's no chance. A nurse. All, all he sees is prunes, man. Every day, prunes. So yeah, Dean, in my book, Dean Hafner, legendary status already. He's proven himself. Um, think about this, man, for, for a minute. So Kim Kardashian, 40% plastic. What? 40%? Get that 40% shit out of here, man. I want that 100%. 100%. Plastic ass to wake me up in the morning. I share my home with at least 12 dolls, plus another five heads that I use in different photo shoots. Guys, just a side note, right? So, you know you know who had 12 bunnies? If you guessed you Hefner, you should probably go wash your hands, because you did some weird shit. <laughs> yeah, it's not weird now, man. It's not weird. The English version, you know, he, I just, obviously, this guy's a, a legend. He's already deserving of legendary status. Could you imagine the type of celebrities he would be pulling to these parties? Jimmy Jimmy Fallon? Jimmy Campbell? I mean, these guys will go absolutely nuts. They will be the first one there and the last one to go home. Just having tea parties with the champ, with Dean, Dean Hefner, you know, talking about their stories. Jimmy Fallon. It started about just over three years ago. I'd always been interested in photography. This is Sarah. She is the first uh, doll I got. So she does have a special place in my heart, I guess, is the right way to put it. There's no right way to put it, Mr. Hafner, I'm sorry. I can remember, you know, it brings tears to my eyes. Rupert, one of my very, very first furry friends. And we would sleep together and cuddle and... Um, Oh, and sometimes we got rough a little bit, but, you know, it's, you know, it's what it is, you know. Well, I, I ordered Sarah. I wasn't really sure what I had in mind. It was just one of those things, like an itch that I wanted to scratch. Shut up, man. You just made you just made me angry, man. You bring back a lot of a lot of memories, man, that I cherish. We used to sing, you know. We used to sing. <laughs> it was fun to Don't give up on me, baby. Life shines Bro, yeah, you used to love that song, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> my, my dolls, I do talk to them occasionally. I became intrigued, really, as to what it would be like to have something that looked very, very real and human in the house, and with, whether that would give me a sense that I had some company here. I can just imagine Mr. Hefner here you know, doing CPR on one of his dolls. All of a sudden, his wife walks in, you know, in a shame. She's just ashamed. She's like, you know what? I don't even know how to feel. My mother and my father warned me about you. And he's just like, no, 
Don't come in here! Don't disturb me while I'm cleaning my room, man! Are you stable? Unlike me. <laughs> yeah. You, you have had a physical relationship with, with one of the, like some of the dogs. Um, well, I wasn't going to talk about that. I mean, I don't with the, the, all my dolls. I, I do, you know, I, what I would say is I'm with the, the, all my, I do, you know, I, what kind of an artist in a sense. Um, I want people to like what I do. I, I do, they're just sex dolls, is they can be great fun, the, all my dolls. I, I do, what I would say is I feel very fond of, I feel very fond of um, Sarah, my first one. And I see it, her as the, the, the I, I don't know what the, see, I don't know what the word is to use. Wow, Dean, come on. Don't don't leave us hanging like that, man. Don't leave us hanging like that. You hit that, man. You hit it. Hit it. You hit it, man. Boy, just tell us the truth. We won't know, boy. You hit that shit. <laughs> you plastic loving son of a bitch. I nearly said person, but she's not a person. But she did open the door to, to what I do now. Come on, man. Just tell us the truth. It's not fair to us, man. Just tell us the truth. You know, We know you hit that shit, man. <laughs> We, I mean, if I was drunk enough, I'd probably hit that shit. You know, I'd think like, yeah, maybe she's just hard to get, you know what I'm saying? You know, her mouth doesn't talk, but, you know, her eyes, she just leads me on, you know what I'm saying? But, you know, if Jimmy Camel and Jimmy Fallon come through, boy, give him one of those ugly, man, those fuglies, man. Give him one of those ugly blowout ass dolls, man, <laughs> so they can role play and shit. They don't deserve to be us, man. You know, I'm very grateful that I found her.